right, welcome back to another episode of Life is Strange. Where we left off, uh, Steph had to go through the emotions, so we played some foosball with her, and um, she got the victory, unfortunately for me, because I suck. <laughs> These controls are completely new to me, so don't fucking judge me in the comments. I'm hoping they didn't. But, um, yeah. Uh... Now it's time to go and see if Gabe was actually telling the truth, or he was he definitely the liar there. We'll see. But yeah, uh, there's also a mine hunt in here. Yeah, dirty clothes. Jesus. Might as well take them to the cleaners. Fuck it. See, I can be a person. Reasonable, right? Foosball tail. Shoo shoo. Hey, shoo shoo. Thanks for sticking around. Yeah, I love that. Uh, do we got any? Wait, what? Oh, we can dress up. Hello. I didn't know we can do that. That's actually pretty interesting. I didn't know we can just help. That's cool. That's so cool. Are there any like unlockables available? Would have been fun to see Gabe crush some sweet powder, or whatever snowboarders say. Ha! <laughs> uh. Well, let's head upstairs. Maybe there's something up here that we need to grab. Answer, my friend, is blowing in the wind. I'll toss those soon. I swear. Bird feeder. No birds today. <sighs> oh, looks like this place is uh, kind of interesting. Is this what he's doing? I bet Gabe there? could even make golf fun. That's a fact. Guarantee he can. Sun and moon. Why look up at the sky when you could look at a sculpture instead? That's a fact. <sighs> but yeah, there's got to be some way we can prove that he did it on purpose. Because why the hell would he literally do something like that knowing the consequences? Alright. Let's see if we can head probably outside the door. Maybe we can do something. We just need to figure out a way to, like, head back and all that, so. You might figure out something. There's no guarantee that we will be able to find anything, but we're gonna be on the search. We're gonna be on the search. Something tells me this got violent down here. Yikes. Like we already know how this is gonna go. Pick it up. Oh, hey kid, you don't have to do that. Too late. Yeah. Wanted to apologize. For all of us. We're all grieving, but that's no excuse. It was your brother's wake, and you both deserve better than listening to a bunch of fools squabble. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. That was pretty rough. Although it's hard to imagine a good version of your dead brother's wake. No, there's no good version. Just all of us trying to get through it together the best we can. Wasn't the first wake held in this old building. I doubt it'll be the last. Anyway, if there's anything I can do, just let me know. I Got need it. to talk to Mac. I know he's lying. I just don't know why. Any idea where I can find him? Well, he helps out Eleanor at the flower shop. 
that be the place to start. Thanks. I feel like I should warn you, though. You might not get the kind of closure you're looking for. If you get any at all. Just... Don't pin all your hopes on Mac Loudon. I get it. Thanks for looking out for me, but... What else am I supposed to do? I wish I had an answer for you. But... If you get a chance before you go all dirty hairy, swing by the dispensary. Charlotte wants to see you. And one more thing. I've been meaning to give you this for the last few days, but I didn't want to disturb you up there. It'll get you through that door and the one upstairs. This is your home now, for as long as you'd like. I guess uh, there is a question with that one. Uh, what about rent? What about rent? I don't want to be a freeloader. Don't worry about that for right now. We'll work out a way for you to earn your keep when the time comes. Got it. Thank you. Thanks. Give him hell. <laughs> gotcha, Jed. I... I have no idea what to even say to him. Is there a way to say hello? I got one from Charlotte. And I got one from Ryan. There's no way to say hello, I guess. <sighs> well, new things as always. <sighs> we have a new objective. Time to go see. Carving. What's that carving right there? What the hell? RM and TB. I wonder who they were. RM and TB. That's a, that's a good question. Mac is going to be a hard time to talk to. <sighs> now we got to interrogate this man. It's just not going to be that easy. <sighs> the fact that we have so many things going on right now is just making things a lot more worse. Mother of God. Okay, Jed said I might find Mac in the flower shop, but I have time to swing by the dispensary if I want. Oh, it's Charlotte. Alex, can you come by the dispensary sometimes? I need your advice. I'll make sure to do so. But first, I need to pay a visit to, uh, good old Mac. Oh, Pike! Hello! I didn't know I was gonna come hey, and see Hey, Pike. You. Hey! Um, how are you holding up? Uh, I'm okay. I'm okay. Okay is good, I think. Hey, I want you to know I meant what I said back there. Gabe was something else. He could bring a smile to my face even on the worst days. Yeah, that's what everyone's been saying. And, uh, when you're ready, I still need to get your statement for the investigation. I'll be ready soon. I think I'll be ready soon. Yeah. Yeah. No rush. Got it, Pike. I'll speak to Pike about that later, though. 
Until I literally talk to Mac. The park looks fun to explore. All the foot traffic. And word around the water cooler is the mining company is about Flyer. to expand. Huh. I got a lot to. Might be a good time on. to check out the dispensary. Jed said Charlotte wants to talk to me. Yeah, I'm actually trying to. Want to do something together next week? Dispensary. Sure. You know what? Since we're nearby, might as well. Well, we can talk to Mac later. <sighs> Sorry. We met briefly. You're Gabe Chen's sister, right? Alex, Diane. Yeah. I didn't know him well, but I could tell he had a big heart. I'm so sorry for your loss. Thanks, Diane. <sighs> Let's see what she got. Charlotte? Alex, hey. Jed said you wanted to see me? I just wanted to see how you were doing. Eh, I'm okay. I'm okay. Keeping my chin up. Sometimes that's all you can do. How about you? I can't even imagine what you're going through. Honestly, I'm really trying to keep it together for Ethan. He's hurting. I hear he's been having a rough time. He practically just lost a father. But he's shutting me out. He's never done that before. Not when it mattered. He just needs time. Everyone grieves differently. Maybe he just needs some time. We've been through a lot together. With the divorce and moving. He's never shut down like this. I just can't get through to him. I can't get over the feeling that the one person who could help me deal with the aftermath of Gabe's death is Gabe. What is this? An affidavit from Typhon. If I sign, I'm agreeing not to press charges in exchange for a payment. A big one. Uh, that's... Not gonna lie to you, Charlie, that's pretty shady. That's so shady. Why would they be offering you money if they didn't do anything wrong? They say it's an offer of good faith. But you're right. He's dead because of them. And I'd be letting them off. Are you gonna sign it? I don't know. I'm trying to put Ethan first, but... What would you do? Do you think it would be a betrayal of Gabe? That is a tough decision. Turn on the offer, take the money for Ethan. Damn! That sucks. Take the money 
for Ethan. You have to put Ethan first. If the money helps, I think you should take it. Thanks, Alex. That means the world. That affidavit feels scummy, but Ethan should come first. No. I really appreciate you stopping by. Feel free to take a look around if you want. No problem. Yeah, okay. <sighs> I think we have a little bit of a minute to go. <clears throat> look for Mac. It's gonna be tough to try to find him though. So, yeah. That's something new. Still need to check the flower shop for Mac. Yep, there it is. So where is the flower shop? It's is the fine. Quest. I love being on hold. I love this song. Um, if I could just find the flower shop, it should be around here somewhere. Ah, oh, found it. Don't look for Mac. <sighs> Don't you fucking. Lie. Eleanor? Oh! oh. <gasps> Sorry. <laughs> no need to apologize. How are you, dear? Oh. I'm, um... I'm alright. I'm okay, I guess. Taking it one moment at a time. It's the best way to be. Is Mac here? Oh, he was helping me not too long ago. I think he just left. Can't have gotten too far. <laughs> Got it. Damn! Thanks. I should have came to the flower shop. She looks terrified. I can't leave her like this. Damn. Let's see what's going on with her. Okay. Time to figure out why she's afraid. The doctor said I had more time, but everything is becoming so out of order. Jesus. This isn't good. All my memories are fading. I feel broken. Definitely not herself, I'll tell you that. Um, something doesn't seem right. Oh, the close sign. If they know if they about, know my, about condition, my condition, they'll make me close, make this, me place. close this place. What? What type of condition does she have? How does she hide all of this? Is there a bathroom? Oh. 
Oh, hello. Thank you, dear. We'll get started on it right away. Just come by with the check whenever you're free. That doesn't seem right. If Riley, if Riley finds, finds out. out. She can't, she can't find, out. find out. Holy shit. What the hell? It's not just that she forgot what she was doing. She's afraid she's forgetting everything. But how can I help her? Um, there's gotta be something. Maybe... Maybe there's something I'm missing. Maybe I can... Forget what you were working on? <laughs> you could say I'm having a bit of a senior moment. <laughs> well, maybe I can help. <sighs> Seems like you have a lot going on today. I could help you retrace your steps. Oh, uh, I don't want to keep you. <sighs> hey. I... I want to help. <laughs> Maybe retracing your steps will help. Okay. What would Eleanor have done first? Uh, let's see. She said, uh, wow, oh wait, I just realized. First? Did you trim these flowers today? I don't remember. Oh boy. <sighs> I guess that's the first thing. Fuck. Um. I guess another thing would be the cash register is second. Mother of God. This shit couldn't have gotten any worse for the both of us. Um, maybe in here? Oh, wait. Did anything happen with Riley? You don't have to do this. I'll be all right on my own. Hey, I'm not going anywhere. Did you maybe call someone? I can't say for sure. Oh, good lord. Oh, this is awkward. Uh, uh, this is very awkward. What in God's name? You were over here when I came in. Maybe you were counting the drawer. I would have done that last night. Interesting. Hmm. Well, she would normally be over here. Yeah, this, this is definitely first. Did you trim these flowers today? I don't remember. Okay, so something didn't seem right when I first did that. Um, okay, so it's clear when I was doing that, I was supposed to, supposed to retrace every step that this wo woman was literally trying to do. The problem was, I forgot which one she was supposed to do first. Oh, hello. You must have flipped the sign to open. I always flip it first thing when I come in. And then I open my mail. Something must have distracted me. Better. We can do this. I guess that's just, she was supposed to read the mail, but something wants to strike her. Hmm. Maybe. Uh. Second. 
Did you trim these flowers today? I don't remember. Okay, so it wasn't the second part. Was it the mail? Re was it the register first? Maybe it was the register first. You were over here when I came in. Maybe you were counting the drawer. I would have done that last night. Damn. Then probably it would, the second one would have been would have been that phone call then. Could a phone call have distracted you? Yes. I got a call first thing in the morning. But I can't think who it was. Maybe we can find something to remind you. The phone. Look. I wonder who called. That's my question. Maybe third? Could it have been Riley who called? I think that's right. She called to tell me about a new order. <sighs> Goodness. What was the order for? Okay, now we're getting somewhere here. Now we're getting somewhere here, thank God. And I think, was, I think, if we go back here, I think this was the trim that was supposed to be earlier. Rush order. This must be what Riley came in for. Probably I think right. that order might have been for these lilies. Of course. Riley helped me pick them out before she left. Now we just have to figure out who ordered them. Um, is there a price tag for these? Because the register leaves it last. The check for the lilies would be in here, right? That could tell us who bought them. Should. Mr. Jedediah Lucan, huh. Looks like the lilies are for Jed. That's right. Riley dropped off an order for Jed. I knew you'd figure it out. I couldn't have done it without you. Seriously, Alex, you're a godsend. Oh. Jed must be hosting some event. I wonder why he wants lilies, though. They're traditionally for funerals. God. She doesn't remember. Should I tell her? Um. Spare the pain. You know Jed. Probably doesn't know the difference between a lily and a tulip. <laughs> <laughs> Don't sell him short. He's more clever than he seems. Yeah, I don't want to do that. She was already fe feared that she Thanks again forgot. for your help. Don't be a stranger. I won't. Promise. All right. She was finally feeling better. I didn't want to ruin that. That's what I'm saying. I gotta leave. Oh, we gotta find find this. Oh, we gotta find Mac. He has to be around here somewhere. We'll talk. To, we'll maybe talk to Ryan maybe in the next few episodes. But right now is just not even a good time right now because we just literally had to settle so many goddamn things. Eleanor said Mac is nearby. I don't see him here. Maybe at the... Let me see this. Anyone has good advice on how to tame street cats? I found this goody, uh, cutie in the trash can. <sighs> but he's a crazy pants. He's a big cat. Jasmine, that's not a stray. That's a mountain lion cub. Be very careful. They can be very aggressive when... It's, try to leave a door open. It may leave on its own. Room? 
It's called animal control. <laughs> Good timing, Mark. <laughs> the bridge? Hmm. Just maybe. I guarantee, I wouldn't guarantee this dude literally walked up towards the bridge. Maybe he did. I didn't see him, though. Oh, there he is. Just the person I was looking for. Mac. Mac. Alex. Look, it's not a good time. You owe me an explanation about what happened to Gabe. What? Costing me my girlfriend wasn't enough for you? Now you're gonna accuse me of killing Gabe, too? I get it. He died on your shift and you're freaked, but you have to come clean. Please. There's nothing I can tell you. Mac, come on. He was my big brother. can't something definitely has him scared maybe if I could tap into his fear I could get to the truth hmm. I just need to find something I could use to push him over the edge good option but what because I don't know exactly what he's afraid of that's that's the thing Hmm. Are Steph not? asked me to pop by the record store if I had time. That's a good option, but now it's not the time. Cause I'm trying to see what it can, what he fears. Cause maybe I can find something on my own, or there has to be something I'm missing. Huh. One doctor had me try meditation. I always just fell asleep. Ah, eh, that says a lot. So she's at the record store right now. I guess now that I can't really do much. Steph asked me. I might as well. Oh. Steph asked me to swing by. She's got to be around here somewhere. Oh. Like she can hear her. She's probably around here somewhere. Oh, who knows? It's probably around here somewhere. Where is she? Oh, back. Said the wrong name. Shut up. <laughs> Val, I just want to be friends. That's a fact. Hoodie guy. Hello. The breakup section, huh? That's rough, buddy. It looks like some of these actually have uh, seen Avatar. Haven's favorite. And only choice for mod. Hey, I'm glad you stopped by. I've only got a sec, but. Have you talked to Ethan at all? He's taking it really hard. But what you did for me this morning got me thinking what if Ethan needs something like that too? Something fun and distracting. Something like a LARP. Like the one you and Gabe were going to take him to? Yeah, but designed just for him and Thanor. Ooh, that's a good idea. He'll love that. Yeah, I'm glad you think so. I need your help, though. I want it to be as good as it can be. Ethan gave you one of his comics, right? So, what do you think? Who would the famous monster slayer have the most fun defeating? Oh, that's tough. Storm Rider of the Undead, or oh, Lord of the. He would. He would definitely. He would definitely do with Cravius. Cravius looks pretty badass. Go with that. <laughs> All right then. Oh, I gotta get back in there. There's some stuff in my comp book. Be cool if you could check it out. 
Help me make some calls. I'll see what I can do. Hey, uh, Haven listeners. That was Phone Tap with their new single, Elephant in the Room. We... a sweet block of indie rock coming down the pike but first a few announcements oh looks like steph wants me to do more than just make some decisions she wants me to play a bard uh, alex fill in the character um the bard uh race have elf bard mm -hmm. <gasps> oh that's gonna be a tough one yes i'm in let's start with my name this year, so bring your friends, bring your family. Hell, bring your ex. I'm sure it'll be different this time. I think There's I'm... beauty and simplicity. Ability time. Distortion field sounds fun, but healing serenade could really come in handy. He will more go with the fun one. Let's go with distortion field. How did I meet Thanor? Heroic story or funny story? Gabe, well, no, no, no. Uh, Ethan would do a lot more with the heroic story. It was a dark and stormy night. This LARP thing just might work. Cause I, Cause I know how the boy feels. I wouldn't even be the surprise if that would be the case. Sign. Helpful. Back at five or ten, maybe fifteen. Mother herder. Um, I'm trying to figure out how can I get this man to be feared by something. There's got to be something. I need to talk to her though. Let me see. Let me see if I can re-talk to her. It's sweet. She's planning a whole LARP for Ethan. Ah, I can't talk to her. Damn! At least not right now. I gotta figure out a way. Way to sort this out. I gotta figure out a way how to actually get Mac to start doing something. Because the thing is, it's hard for me to try to get him out of that. It really is. Like, you have a sensitivity that the man is like literally have certain fears, but from as far as I know, it's gonna be hard to like tap in his darkest fears. Hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, make sure to leave a like. Also hit that subscribe button if you are new to the channel. It's been Zach, guys. Later.